Hi guys, this is Javon Roseburg. I'm still here in Richmond, Virginia. Um, and I actually ran into one of my old friends. I called him up and he came through here to, to check me out for a while. Uh, I met this guy in the military. We jumped out a few planes together. We was actually in the same unit, HSB 1st 319, 82nd Airborne Division. Uh, we stand out here in front of the Days Inn. He's actually, uh, he actually has a marketing company here in Richmond, Virginia. Uh, and you can check out his website, www.soulevents.va.com. That's www.soulevents.va.com. Guys, the police rolling around here. You know what they do, right? Protect and serve. But let me introduce you to my friend, good friend of mine, known him for probably about, you know, 10 or 11 years now. Corey King. Corey, say what's up to the folks, dog. What's up, folks? How you doing? All right. So, uh, Corey, check it out. You, you know what we're doing on this walk. Uh, and actually, like, you, you've been following since the beginning. Like, what do you think about everything that's going on? I think it's pretty amazing, just the, the whole concept and the idea. Especially if you get enough people, you know, really behind you, you really could start a big movement. I mean, I think it's, it's pretty commendable that you're actually walking this far. So, I have to say, I'm definitely proud of you. Well, I appreciate that. Like, me and Corey, we got into a conversation a little while ago, and uh, he was telling me about something that happened when he was with his daughter, uh, actually, last weekend. And, uh, like, it, it was a beautiful thing, and I, I just wanted him to share, like, exactly what happened with y'all. Because um, it's a blessing, it's, it's exactly what we need to be doing. But, uh... I'm gonna let you. I'm gonna let him share his story with you, and it's a beautiful thing. And y'all really need to pay attention uh, to what he's about to say because, like, we need to teach our kids to. Wow, it's certain things we need to teach our kids. They need to obtain like certain values that's actually going to make this country and this world a better place. And it was just a beautiful story. I'm gonna get him to share it with y'all real quick. So, uh, Corey, what, what happened when uh, you was out with your daughter? Mm, okay, yeah, I wouldn't really say much of a story, but, you know, I've, I've always tried to, like, when I see somebody who can't really do a lot for themselves, try to help out, even if it's just a dollar, because a dollar to us ain't nothing, but, you know, somebody else, that's a big blessing. Um, just actually me and my daughter was going to eat sushi, just coincidentally, in downtown Richmond, there was a, a, a guy in a wheelchair, he had no legs, you know, just in the, in the wheelchair, shaking the, his cup of change. You know, I tossed him a couple a couple bucks said God bless, and uh, you know, it just so happens my daughter was with me, so I just, you know, kind of gave her a quick lesson. You know, it's it's nice to be able to give people, especially when you know that they probably having a hard time doing it for themselves. I mean, it's different. You see a lot of these guys out here, you know, bumming for money when they looks like they're perfectly healthy and probably can get a job. But this guy, I mean, you could tell life had dealt him a bad hand, like he had no legs and you know looked like he didn't have a place to live. So I had to help him out where I could, and I definitely think I taught my daughter a good lesson. You know, exactly. At the same time. Exactly. Guys, that's beautiful. Um, and guys, and like the whole purpose of this walk is that, that everybody needs to get in the spirit of, of helping other people um, and giving, like not expecting anything in return. Like the, the, this whole moratorium on self selflessness walk is, is is built on a platform of selfless acts uh, that we all can do. And it's just so beautiful to, to hear a young man who, who's actually out with his daughter and for him to experience that with his daughter and actually teach her a, a, a lesson, a valuable lesson that's going to stick with her for the rest of her life. Um, that's just amazing and beautiful to me. But I definitely want you all to check him out. Uh, like His marketing company is doing great things here in Richmond, uh, Virginia. Beautiful thing. That's www dot soul events va dot com again it's www dot s o l e v e n t s v a dot com but he, he's from Wilmington North Carolina folks so uh, you know exactly what it is so that's a beautiful thing again this is my homeboy Corey we jumped out a few planes together been out in the field together in the 82nd Airborne Division and it's just a blessing he was here in Richmond decided to check me out like I, I got some rain today so it ain't gonna be too much going on probably uh, work on my journal a little bit and uh, you know take care of some other things but again this is my this is my homeboy Corey L. King if y'all in Richmond Virginia if you're ever in the VA area definitely check out his 
website. Uh, and, and, and the name of one of the spots that he's actually doing some marketing work for is Aurora. Aurora. Uh, 401 East Grace Street, corner of 4th and Grace. Always got, you know, good jazz on Thursdays, nice parties on Fridays, Saturdays. Good food. Where that's a that's a beautiful thing. But I, I'm gonna get it y'all later. Again, this is Javon Rosebro. I'm here with my friend Corey King. Uh y'all be blessed. I'm gonna get it y'all later.